I have been working at the National Library Service for close to 40, next year will be 40 years. And during my tenure at the library, especially during the formative years, I noticed that reading was a family issue. Parents brought their children to the library on Saturday mornings. This over at Corey Street, the old library, children used to be on the steps from the top to the bottom in the courtyard, accompanied by their parents. Literacy begins in the home. And that is something that I know that the parents knew because they brought the children to the library, they stayed with them, and sometimes they were even involved in their choosing of the books and, and so forth. But now, today, children, they have a lot of distractions, as I would call them. They have the tablets, a me tablet might not be a distraction, but can be for children. Because half of them do not read on, the, on these different devices. A lot of them play games, they are not reading and the parents are not really supervising what they are doing on the internet. Um, so the, the, the children are kind of supervising themselves. The parents are taken out of the equation to a large extent. On Saturday mornings, we have story hour and we always had that for years. They, it has dwindled more and more because the parents are, sometimes they, they come occasionally, but they have karate, they have dancing, they have swimming, they have everything. And reading is always on the back burner. That is something that I would like to change, but we have to now tap in now to uh, uh, family literacy more. I, we have a program at the library, um, we, we stopped during the COVID environment, but this is something we have to revamp. We went to the government polyclinics, the Parents' Association, and we spoke to parents about the importance of literacy, and more importantly, about the role of the family in children's literacy development. That is critical and that is what is selling the Ministry of Education. The Ministry cannot do all, we cannot do all. We have to have the support of the community. Reading is our thing in Barbados. It is not one person say, not the other. It is entire Barbados. So we have to come together nationally and, and, and try to make change. We have to encourage children to read. We have to revamp it. We have to inculcate that culture of reading in Barbados again.